Welcome back, everybody. I'm here with Maestro Hector Guzman and, of course, Dr. Mark Francis, who's the um, director, uh, executive director of the Corpus Christi Symphony, and they've got a big show coming up if you haven't heard about it yet. But the question that some of you might have is, how in the world can you put a mariachi and a symphony together? Isn't that an, an oxymoron? Uh, no. How would you answer that, doctor? Uh, well, it, they're the same notes. Really? Yeah, they play the same notes, the styles are different, but it's the same notes and uh, that's what makes music so amazing. And universal. Yeah, absolutely. Now, you are going to be playing mariachi songs with the symphony. Now, how does the symphony guys take this? <laughs> <laughs> they seem to be pretty good with it. They actually are looking forward to it. Yeah. It's uh, really, it, you know, they like uh, variety in, in, in the music they play. They don't just want to play one thing. Well, now, the songs are, are stringed instruments, basically. So the, your uh, symphony people are going to be reading the notes as they go. I mean, they're accompanying the mariachi, right? Yeah, yeah, all of the sections, yeah. How would you direct that <laughs> with big arms? <laughs> <laughs> well, the mariachi and I have been performing uh, together on and off for the last 15 years. Oh, you know them well. Uh, they know me well, I know them well, I know how they do things, and it, the job of, of me, myself, is just to keep them together. Right. The orchestra has to follow the mariachi because right. it is not an easy task. Yeah. The mariachi have, has its own rhythm yep. and uh, idiosyncrasies, and so we have to follow, and that's a challenge. If you've never seen uh, either Vargas or the symphony, it was kind of like two different things, this is the place and the time to see them. It'll be at Selena Auditorium, Doctor. What time and where? 7.30, Selena Auditorium, January 12th, this Saturday. And yeah. where can people get tickets? Go to our website, ccsymphony.org, or the box office at the American Bank Center. That's probably the easiest way, just to yeah, swing sure. by there and pick up some tickets. Uh, the, uh, do the symphony people get a special deal, or is this part of their annual... Oh, no, we can't say anything about that. Okay, well, because they're season ticket holders, uh, they're going to be there, and we want you to come join them. Now, Vargas, uh, as we've talked about, the, the, the group itself has been around for, what, 100 years? 115 years. 115 years, but it's not the same musicians. Okay, <laughs> hopefully not. <laughs> uh, but there have been people who've grown up in this. So it's five a generations. It's a unique uh, yes. group. So tell them about the five generations. Well, it started with Silvestre Vargas uh, over a hundred years ago and through the generation after generation. That's why the style is so unique of the Mariachi Vargas because this is a style that you don't learn. You're born with it. Wow. <laughs> so that's what makes it very special. Accomplished musicians from yes. two different genres all on one stage. It's going to be a big show and we want, and we want to see you there. Uh, so join us on Saturday night at the Selena Auditorium for Vargas and the Symphony. We'll